Hi guys, back again. Um, we haven't talked about running costs uh, yet and uh, anyone who's looked at buying a spa and has been around a few shops will probably have heard the, the, the classic which is, oh yeah, it's about a pound a day. It's utter nonsense. Uh, it's summer here, it's warm out, this is incredibly well insulated and the running uh, costs for the past five days have been, if that, if you can see that, £9.44. We have uh, one of these OWL systems connected just to the spa. It's been programmed with the pence per minute units and our Economy 7 uh, units rate plus the times that the Economy 7 is, uh, is active and uh, we're getting close to probably £2 a day which isn't a problem uh, particularly for, for us but uh, if you've been told a pound a day um, you know it's, it's just not true uh, it might be if you're not using it um, and don't forget we've got it at 36.5 not uh, 38.5 and uh, I'm sure there's a difference uh, in co running costs just by dropping it a degree or to lower or higher uh, so yeah if you've been told a pound a day uh, I think that's probably going to be inaccurate <laughs> to be uh, kind god these I don't know whether you can see that these bloody little thunderflies are everywhere and I've actually got one inside this because um, I've had it outside <laughs> for the last half an hour um, they're all over the spa they're Pain in the backside, get into LCD screens and uh, all sorts. Hopefully, it will make make its way out and not die right in the middle of the display. Anyway, so yes, pound a day, no, um, two pounds a day, one fifty, two pounds a day. I think is more uh, more accurate. And if uh, no, we only use this maximum three times a day, I would say, and probably for fifteen or twenty minutes. Uh, and it is well insulated uh, so yeah catch you later